New at 11 o'clock, we're now hearing from family members of a Maryland National Guardsman that was shot to death in a confrontation with his next door neighbor. That as we learn more about a history of conflict between Javon Prather and a NASA employee that police say shot him. Our Annalisa Gill joining us live from the scene in Springfield. Annalisa, break this down. What happened here? Well, Jonathan, that's what we're all trying to figure out right now. But we know the shooting happened near these townhomes right behind me. Family members, like I said, have more questions than answers tonight. They say their young son had a bright future and he was looking forward to continuing his service to this country. There is active CPR on the side of the uh, victim. Yeah, suspect is in 7114. That draws the next door neighbor. Emergency responders rushed in to save Maryland National Guard member Javon Prather on Tuesday afternoon just before 5 p.m. after police say his neighbor, Michael Heddle, shot him at least five times. We are en route to... 7114 Bedstraw Court to check on the wife and two children of the shooter. The shooter is in custody. Victim is cardiac arrest. Active CPR. It appears it all started when police got a call for a noise complaint from the neighborhood. There's one event, the noise complaint that was called in from 7112. Heddle, who is a former police officer in Washington State, charged with second-degree murder in Prather's death. Other neighbors say this isn't the first time that police have responded to a dispute between the two. There's some bickering going back and forth between him and the neighbor, but just like petty stuff, um, they, I don't think they really care for each other. Prather's aunt, LaShawn, says she doesn't know the motive behind the shooting, but she admits there was tension. I don't think that any there, there's any reason to take it to the level of taking someone else's life. Whether they liked each other or not, I just want to make sure that justice is served because the fact is that my nephew's life was taken prematurely. He was only 24 years old. And family members say Javon voted for the first time yesterday on Super Tuesday. Heddle was scheduled to appear in court on March 12th. Live from Springfield tonight, Annalisa Gale, ABC 7 News. Annalisa, thank you.